Hello guys, welcome back again to my channel. On this video, I'm gonna show you how to change the name and passwords of your router or wireless modem. And uh, this is actually a video that continues after the first one that I showed you, where you could use your wireless router as a Wi-Fi extender, as a Wi-Fi repeater. And now I'm making a video about you guys how to change the name and password of the extended network or the extended router. So if you don't know how to go on this page right here, I am going to put a shortcut on the video down on the main video and you can see there how you can get up to here so let's continue we go on wireless this part here connect to network actually shows us the main router on which we are connected and then we go on extended network this is our router here we have the name of the main router that is automatically put on here and we can change the name here put whatever we want I don't know just extended net Wi-Fi it's too hard extended Wi-Fi and here you can if you click on this it just automatically gets the name of the main wireless on which you are connected so external Wi-Fi here is the password, this is the password for the last, for the main wireless and we can change it here and put whatever we want. I'm just gonna put a simple one so it's gonna be easy for me to connect. Then the next step, just save it. It's gonna take a couple of minutes. So... I'm just gonna wait for here it is external Wi-Fi I'm gonna connect to this one password be sure on that it's okay next and waiting for the connection It's gonna take a couple of seconds until the router actually it's on its full capacity. Now it should be the case. Yep, so we go on wireless, extended network, and here you can see the name password that we saved from last time, and here the name of the Wi-Fi and that we're actually connected. We might want to check that internet connection, just go on google.com Feeling lucky And it works YouTube It works good I would like to show you also on this video How you can Directly Put the name and password for your router so no extended router, just your normal router at home. Admin, admin, login, root, wireless, basic settings, okay. 
I didn't know that. So here it's also on my wireless. You can just generate a new password and leave it like that. I didn't know that. It's nice though. So we are not interested in that. We go on wireless security and we have our password. I am gonna make my password simple so it's easier for me to connect and then just save it the moment this is gonna be saved we are going to get again locked out or disconnected from our router it happened and then I must reconnect with uh, the new password. So first I might want to forget this network. Forget, connect. Now it's gonna ask me for the new password. Here, connect, okay. Just doesn't want to do it. So here, one more time. Connect password. <clears throat> now it's gonna connect slowly but it's gonna connect connected no internet we just want to refresh this page it's not it's going so one more time wireless security and here we have our password changed and saved so now we want to change our wireless name also called SSID as you can read over here <laughs> this is funny actually although name external Wi-Fi just save it Okay, now it should be done. Yeah, external Wi Fi. Connect key. connected we want to refresh here and then uh, basic settings and here we have it external Wi-Fi so as you saw it it's it was pretty easy also on other routers you will just have another Wi-Fi address on which you want to connect with or um, just a wipe IP address looks like this one 192.168.0.1 just want to hit enter on that and uh, you're gonna get the same page for the settings for the main settings of your router okay guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe on my channel 
and uh, if you like the video hit that like button see you on the next video bye